Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Victoria Ryan. Hi, hello. Sorry, I am very late to posting more reactions. I had to go through some mental breakdowns, and I have a feeling this song is gonna give me another one. So we are going to be looking back into the Ren rabbit hole. If you missed my last reaction of Ren, it was the first, very first one I've ever done of his, and it was Hi Ren. So today, I don't know why in the hell I keep putting myself through this, but we're going to be checking out more of these rabbit holes. We're going to be checking out more of Ren and diving deep into his music a little bit more. And let's just go ahead and jump right into this because we're going, we're going to do a deep dive. Sick boy, this was posted like five months ago, I believe. So, hey, right, let's go. <laughs> Seeing me. Looking at your file here, it seems there's a very apparent interplay with your emotional state and your physical body. Have you ever heard of the trauma response? I don't think so. Basically, our bodies can get stuck in a negative feedback loop. Our subconscious can repeat patterns from the past, which can have a pretty drastic downstream effect on our biology. Essentially, your mind is making you To break boy oh what a shame he's in pain have another go take another pill here take a couple more let's see how you're doing in another week or so you'll be feeling worse when the side effects will show derealization medical patient losing patience with the process walking hand in hand with satan complications with the medication inflammation dehydration inhalation aggravation building up a toleration drown soccer drown soccer drown soccer drown i've been feeling like i'm drowning with my feet upon the ground i've been screaming i've been shouting but i never for a way out but i always seem to drown is this all making sense Ren? um yeah i think so good what i propose we do is we try to pinpoint the exact experiences from the past that are keeping you stuck what can you tell me about your childhood uh, i can't really think it's okay if nothing comes up right away what i'd like you to do is take some deep breaths with me in and out Tell me the first thing that comes to your mind. I feel like it's not me. It's the world that's it. We're given everything we need and we commoditize it. We consume, we destroy like we're parasitic. Science tells us that it's suicide and still we come in. I'm not sick. We are sick. We are standing on a cliff in the name of progress. We jump off the precipice. I'm not sick. I'm the virus. You're the virus, hypocrite. How can you sit there with a smile on and tell me that I'm sick? Sick boy, sick boy, looking for a fix, boy. Push it down in public, quick pose for the pick, boy. Record label meetings that come on the Gift boy, why are you so upset? Don't you wanna be a rich boy? Fuck no, industry is cutthroat. I've been doing bits by myself, swimming backstroke, walking on a tightrope, rapping with a slit throat. The way that we persist is like the ending of a bad joke. As the people of old, we're complacent to assailants and we do what we're told. Counterintelligence is sight to behold. Rape the earth of all resources and we bleed it for gold. And we bleed it for wealth, we bleed it for fame. But when you bleed it, can you tell me what the fuck will remain? parts and I was like oh that that hurts like you just I don't know like you just feel it you're just like the whole entire time just like in it with him and it's so fascinating like this dude's brain is fascinating I like it I, I it's sad how do I put this this is so weird it's like ah oh, it, it, it it feels very joker like where it's like, ha ha ha, I'm in pain, but not that he's laughing about it. It's just like very this aggressive, can't you see it? Like, this is fucked up, but I'm going to put it in like a, ah, God, I don't even know how to put it into words. But it's it feels like Joker-ish, where he's like laughing, or it, not even laughing. It's like he's like, I don't know, Joker vibes, 
but like in a <laughs> I'm sick kind of like um okay shoot who was that last joker oh shoot what, what, what was his name that has a funky name oh and it was my favorite joker too shit who was it he was the um the the jack juan Quan suprenix or something like you know what i'm talking about like that joker i don't know if there's been any other ones since then but like that joker that's ren but like a, a younger you know attractive dude not that Quan renix isn't but like does that make sense? And that's what it reminds me of. It's like, you know, society's fucked up and, you know, I'm sick, I'm sick. Society's fucked. It's just like, it's just this back and forth of aggressive with the world and with himself. It's like this, like, constant, like, the dude's literally at war with himself and with his sickness and with society. Like, I like it. The whole entire time you're just like, yeah, uh-huh, what? Happy? Ooh. Ah? Ooh. Like, that, that was like his back and forth. It's like, should I be crying? Should I be like, mm -hmm, yeah, I agree. Like, it's just so du -du 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 like a, a ping pong match of emotions the entire time. Both of his songs so far. It's just like, du -du -du -du. I feel myself tearing up like, oh, shit. And then I'm like, oh, yeah, shit. Yeah. Mm. And then it's like, oh, shit again. Even like the therapist part that's like doing the singing, rapping thing on her end. It works. Like, you know how like some music videos and stuff where it's like they pause the music for a second and then they start talking and like doing like the movie scene of the music video you know what I mean like they they pause the music and then they they show like a scene and you're like yeah 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 and you skip it because you want to hear the music again you don't do that with him like the entire time like even the therapist part when it took a break from his music and went to her you're not like yeah 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 let me skip this like you want to hear what she says too and it's just like it's very artistic and it's very just captivating the entire time because usually like and I, I hate to do this but like country music does it sometimes at least like the old country like early 2000s country would do that if I wanted to listen to the song I would skip I, or I would not pick the music video because it's like ugh, people are talking or ugh, that you know have that little cut scene this cut scene works and you don't have to skip it so like if I was like listening to this song with my friends I would still pick the music video I wouldn't pick the lyric video there we go I wouldn't pick the lyric video because this works if that makes sense like it just it works and it's artistry, and I like it. This man scares me, but I like it. I like the scariness. But it's very just, God, it's an aggressive sad. Like, ugh. He just, like, he pulls on your heartstrings, but, like, damn, that's a good video. Like, it's, like, it, 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 I hope it doesn't, like, come across as, like, disrespectful because... You know, the dude's going through it, so I don't mean to sit here and, like, I'm laughing at him or something and, like, oh, yeah, this is a really cool music video. No. I feel like he's putting the trauma and putting the sickness on display in a way that it's not necessarily glorifying it, but it's, like, it's bringing an artistic realization to it that's not... Oh, how do I put this? That's not, hey, feel sorry for me, or, hey, yeah, the world sucks, I hate everybody. It's not either of those vibes. It's just a very realistic, this is how it is, but then also, like, don't feel sorry for me. Like, he doesn't, like, portrays himself as a victim, and it's like, oh my god, everybody feel bad for me. No. Like, he's projecting like he's putting his feelings out there in a way that where people can understand it but it's not a victim mindset if that makes sense like he's not expecting the world to feel sorry for him but hey this is what i'm going through and i appreciate that so much because that to me is an art form it's not asking for sympathy from people i mean you, f you feel it naturally like if you're an empathetic person and you watch this and you're just like oh for listening purposes, I like this one more than high red. Listening purposes, you know, for like this one. I like this one. 
it's like he gives you enough of him to where you want to learn more, which is cool. He's got like this. Oh, this is gonna sound weird. He's got like this mysteriousness. Even though he's putting himself out there, there's still like a mystery to him that's like very like what? Like who is who is Ren? Like, you know, like does that make sense? I don't know. But that's just kind of like first feelings, first thoughts, first impressions, and especially with this video, you just get like a lot of like who is this guy? But in a very captivating way, in a very artistic way. Let me know if you agree or disagree. If you got a different take from this, if you got a different interpretation than from me, let me know. Uh, definitely let me know how you're feeling. Did you cry? Are you mad? Combination of the two. <laughs> Just like, I want to cry, but then like, I pull back. It's like, wait a minute, now I'm mad again? Like, it's just, he gets you like pulled in so many different directions and it's very fascinating that he's able to achieve that. And thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. Don't forget to subscribe if you like this type of content. I want to keep up with the Ren journey that we're on. We've got more Tom McDonald coming up and Nova and we got to do some more Up Church. I need to finally do more Adam Calhoun. I've been meaning to freaking forever, but the music industry be plopping these days. But, uh... Subscribe for that, and just to give you my full spiel, I'm also a Escape from Tarkov Twitch streamer. You can find me every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday, 8.30 p.m. EST. I also stream on Kick. I do GTA roleplay over there. I'm learning it. I do that every Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday at 8.30 p.m. EST. It's my name, Victoria Ryan, and also on all socials, I'm at Spooky Squirrel. So go follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I appreciate it. And also, if you haven't checked out my first, my very, very, very first friend reaction, check it out. The, the camera's inverted. Check it out here. Yeah, I'll put it right here. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I appreciate you so much. Happy listening. Love your face. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye, guys.